I know it's hard for you guys to notice, but Q Clash hasn't updated in a while. You know what? To those of you who knew that Q Clash hasn't updated in a while, I, I have one thing to say to you. Oh my gosh, you're so insightful. I hope I can become as smart as you one day. Yeah, I goalie should get his crap together because he doesn't have a life outside of Roblox. Being all that, it, it is true. Q Clash has not updated in a long while. If you don't call the Christmas update. But um, today I'll be explaining what will be coming to Q Clash and also just when to expect it to happen. Also, the reason why some updates in general in the past have taken so long and why the game hadn't updated originally. So, yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so preceding the update to Q Clash of, you know, the major update live, Pro Light Peak Perch Pro, after that, it was a little bit silent for a while, and remember, this was a map made by Jimmy, so after that, he got Contributor Role, and after that, it was kind of silent. He made a couple changes to the Discord, but then on Cl Mary Q Clashmas, which was released on the 12th, so, um, you know, at the very end of the year, on the 16th, and, you know, that was an awesome event, but before that, it was very, very silent. In fact, before that, the ma last major update was the Pit update, and I call it the Pit update because... It was whether or not the pit on, you know, the last map, um, what's it freaking called? You, you know that map. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll just stick with that, but you, you know what I'm talking about. The point is that was the last update before that, and it was kind of quiet. Now, I know the main reason why it was quiet was because, one, Golly said that, you know, Q-Clash wasn't racking up as much money as it did when it was more popular, so they had to find, you know, other means of that. And another reason was because a lot of stuff that was happening in every and every all the devs lives in general for example i know golly experienced a lot of wildfires in california so that was something um but yeah that was one of the major things there were a couple other problems but they weren't nearly worth as well mentioning so there's that now to talk about what's coming to q clash and what's supposed to come so you know dev updates alert is where a lot of people go for their good old information on q clash but what you probably didn't know was there was a there was an original dev update alert where they told us a little bit more, more than just you know projectiles, aiming, and all that. So originally in the other dev update alert, there were it showed a lot of um, things Golly wanted to come in the future. For example, he wanted servers um, to be manageable by the owners for private server owners, so people could you know make their own custom servers, you know, um, make teams. Some in some cases you could even poison people with commands or. You could give clashers like Sir Knight ghost his rifle, uh, vice versa. So that's one of his plans. But that was supposed to happen after the engine. So I can see why he got rid of it and um, put the new dev updates alert. Also, um, to anyone who's a tester, you'll remember this. To anyone who wasn't a tester, you probably won't remember this. Just because it was kind of, you know, not talked about as much. Just because it was something that they wanted to happen. Not not more so that something was going to happen. Now, the dev updates, dev updates alert is nowadays is you know it's still pretty good you have you know the the casual watching ghost is grenade aim and you know gullies now back on to updating things that are, ha have already been fixed are key bindings bullets projectiles replication kit state conditions animations dive slash leap slash wings instant projectile cast field themes shields health damage and right now he's working on better melee and knockback now the reason why these last two are so important is because they're so detrimental to the game. For one, melee used to be a thing back with, you know, the original Q-Clash. Reaper used to have a sight. The Sir Knight used to throw his head. Um, pretty sure Rascal had a wrench. Decker had a knife which backstabbed, so it was literally spy from TF2. But moving on, the point is, it, bringing all that back would change the game by a lot. Instead of having to deal with Sheila's up close, you could just pull out your melee and threaten them for getting too close to you as a cyborg. We don't know what the melees will be. We don't know if they're going to be the same or if they're going to change completely, but we do know it's coming back. And for those of you who think he's talking about better melee for Sir Knight, I'm, I would agree on you with that, but the problem is Sir Knight's melee is just fine. And plus, Golly's already talked about having a whole separate thing, making Sir Knight more prone to AoE damage, so better melee wouldn't be helping that. And on top of that, we have knockback, which is something that's so detrimental to the game, even more than melee. Yeah, you know that time you got hit by a rascal and you just got blasted 20 feet back with his shotgun? Yeah, that, that, that needs to be worked out. Knockback isn't a very common thing in Q-Clash for a lot of weapons, but I can tell you one thing. 
Rascal has the most knockback, even more than Sir Knight, which makes almost no sense to me, because whenever you fight a Rascal and you jump at him, you basically done the stupid, you know, oh my oh, ah, shinderu crap, you're already dead, because now he can just blast you again, and then blast you again. It's like air blast, but air blast with a shotgun, it, it, it's just so overpowered. Getting back on track, that's the stuff that's supposed to come. So basically, the user input engine progress is already 13 out of 15% done. On top of that, Gull is working on, on bugs. He's trying to, and I quote, collect them all. And he he isn't the best programmer or anything, but still, he's doing his job. Now, recently, Gully got into a car crash. Pretty sure got a concussion. Pretty bad. So, the state of the game is still being worked out. So, you know, Gully's, st Gully's still working on the game. No worries. He's fine. Hopefully, you're worried about he's fine. Not that it's just the game updating. He has a life. Um, But, yeah. So... Otherwise, that's it for that. And if you guys are wondering the gameplay in the background, it, it, it it's a secret, guys. Um, my secret. But um, thanks for listening, guys. I hope this cleared up what's happening in the update for you. You know, other stuff. Um, but until then, keep clashing and you know, keep waiting for updates.